Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to this week's Toddler Tuesday video. My name is Miss Alexa. Good morning, and my name is Miss Artiaga. And this week's theme is how Jesus' power helps us to be good friends. Now, Miss Artiaga is going to be leading us in the opening prayer. Okay, boys and girls, let's put our hands together. Close your eyes. The sun is up, and I am too. I say good morning, God, to you. Thank you for letting us gather with our friends today. Amen. Amen. And now we're going to be doing something a little different this week and starting off with a little song called This Little Light of Mine. So come and join us. Okay, boys and girls, now join us as we sing a song called This Little Light of Mine. This, this little, little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine. I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. I'm gonna take this light around the world. I'm gonna let it shine. Gonna take this light around the world. I'm gonna let it shine. Gonna take this light around the world. I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. That sure was fun. Yes, it was. <laughs> now we're going to be reading a story called The Little Red Hen. The Little Red Hen. Once upon a time, there was a little red hen who lived on a farm with a dog, a pig, and a cat. The little red hen worked very hard every day to grow plants in her garden. The dog, the pig, and the cat did nothing but sleep all day in the warm sun and watch the little red hen work in her garden. One day, the little red hen found a grain of wheat. Who will help me plant this wheat so that we can eat fresh bread? She said, Not I, said the dog. Not I, said the pig. Not I, said the cat. Fine, I will plant it myself then, said the little red hen and so she planted the grain of wheat. The little red hen took very good care of her wheat, but the dog, the pig, and the cat said that they were too tired to help her. By the end of the summer, the wheat grew very tall, and it was time to cut the wheat and take it to the mill. Who will help me cut the wheat and take it to the mill so that we can have fresh bread? Not I, said the dog. Not I, said the pig. Not I, said the cat. Well then, I will have to take it to the mill by myself, said the little red hen. So she cut the wheat and set off for the mill. After the miller made the wheat into flour, she came back to the farm and asked, Now, who will help me bake the bread? Not I, said the dog. Not I, said the pig. Not I, said the cat. Well then, I will just bake the bread myself and she did just that. She mixed the flour with salt and yeast to make the dough. And when the dough rose, she put it in the oven to bake. When the bread was all done, she asked, now who will help me eat the bread? I will, said the dog. I will, said the pig. I will, said the cat. No, you will not, said the little red hen. You did not help me plant the grain. You did not help me care for it. You did not help me cut it and take it to the mill. You did not even help me bake the bread. So I will eat it myself. And she did just that. Boys and girls, wasn't that a wonderful story about friends? That's one of my favorites. Boys and girls, it's important to remember that God tells us it's very important to be nice and to love everyone. God was a good friend to many, many people, all different types. And you should always share and be kind to your friends and help them when they need it. Sometimes you'll need help and they'll wanna help you too. So now we're going to be singing a new song called, I've Got Peace Like a River. 
Okay, now join us as we sing a fun song called I've Got Peace Like a River. I've got peace like a river, I've got peace like a river, I've got peace like a river in my soul. I've got peace like a river, I've got peace like a river, I've got peace like a river in my soul. I've got love like an ocean, I've got love like an ocean, I've got love like an ocean in my soul. I've got love like an ocean, I've got love like an ocean, I've got love like an ocean in my soul. I've got joy like a fountain, I've got joy like a fountain, I've got joy like a fountain in my soul. I've got joy like a fountain, I've got joy like a fountain, I've got joy like a fountain in my soul. I've got peace, love, and joy like a river. I've got peace, love, and joy like a river. I've got peace, love, and joy like a river in my soul. I've got peace, love, and joy like a river. I've got peace, love, and joy like a river. I've got peace, love, and joy like a river in my soul. I've got peace, love, and joy like an ocean. I've got peace, love, and joy like an ocean. I've got peace, love, and joy like an ocean in my soul. I've got peace, love, and joy like an ocean. I've got peace, love, and joy like an ocean. I've got peace, love, and joy like an ocean in my soul. I've got peace, love, and joy like a fountain. I've got peace, love, and joy like a fountain. I've got peace, love, and joy like a fountain in my soul. I've got peace, love, and joy like a fountain. I've got peace, love, and joy like a fountain. I've got peace, love, and joy like a fountain in my soul. Wow, that was a really fun song to sing. <laughs> it sure was. And boys and girls, don't worry if you don't remember all the words right now. We're going to continue singing I've Got Peace Like a River and This Little Light of Mine every week so that you can learn to sing all the words along too. So now, Ms. Artiaga is leading us in the closing prayer. Okay, great. Put your hands together. Close your eyes. Dear God, help me be a friend today in all that I do and all that I say. Thank you for giving me many great friends and letting us share today. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much for joining us, and I'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.